lot of times uh, we do whatever we have to, but you know, sometimes it's not that high, sometimes you barely see it. But if I get this thing going here and get in there, you can feel the cavity. Incidentally, this stuff coming out, it looks a lot like white lung disease when you hit it with the, the burr. It's real powdery and fine, and it's soft with the burr. <laughs> Open up that crack as high as I can reach with this. It's a little half round nipper uh, that I have. Just to get me started, I can use a skinny loot knife to reach in there and clean up those edges, get to the bottom of the separation. But this the key part here is right here. This is where that white line, in, in a toe crack, this is where that white line disease is active. And it really doesn't matter what happens down below. We have got to get all of that opened up so that it stays clean, it stays dry, and they can treat it. If we don't do that, the white line disease is not going away, the crab isn't going to stop migrating. <laughs> Stretch it and it will have conform. 
consumption. That one seems to be the best I've ever found, and that is Epoch. I just went into you all and saw them there and I bought this one that's going out of those. Like six bucks for the wall. So I started out making these patches and I'll just uh, coat the, the fiberglass. I like to get it on my fingers, like so. Critical the, the fiberglass with my fingers and pregnate it and then I will fold it on itself several times to the width that I want, the length I should say. And I might even fold it long ways too, like a half fold. You know, like the thinner half to go up the hoof wall, kind of taper into the con to contour better. And that would go on there, like so, we we'll fill this cavity first. I also like to have one gluing. I like to rub in the layer with my hands, get good adhesion to the hoof, and then I'm bonding after that, I'm bonding glue to glue. And it works out better. Here, we'll break the bottom of this foot. At this point, I will bring the horse behind and stretch out. First one's got to be easy. And there we are. They can get to the root of the white line disease. The toe is fixed. 